I finally convinced Marcus to let me go out. I'd slept most of the day, and he'd stayed to watch over me. I needed to get out and get back in touch with reality. My physical condition was deteriorating rapidly. My mental state wasn't much better. I could feel myself slipping away. I knew that it wouldn't be long before I lost it. Hello, I'm Detective Carla Valenti, NYPD. The police, they found me. Richard III. I often read Shakespeare. I like the sober, desperate tone. Marcus gave me this book, along with the one I left in the restaurant. Better not leave it lying around. torn piece of computer paper. I think I must have used it for a bookmark. Uh-oh, I'd better try to hide this. Hello, I'm Detective Carla Valenti, NYPD. You are Lucas Kane, right? I'd like to ask you a couple of questions. You've got questions you need to ask me? Well, it's worth a try. It won't take very long. What do you want to know? Could you confirm that this list came from here at the bank? Will he say something about the watermark? The paper does come from here. It has our bank ID code and the watermark. Is there a way to establish where it was printed from? The manager already filled me in, but maybe we can learn something more. This kind of paper is used by stock buyers to print out their quotes. There's about a hundred of them here in the bank. This guy seems really tense. Probably nervous about being questioned by the police. Is there a problem, Mr. Kane? Huh? Oh, uh, no, no, sorry. Is there a way to determine where this particular document was printed out? What's his problem? Seems like my questions are upsetting him. Listen, uh, I've had a real hard day, so if you don't mind... I've had a hard day too, Mr. Kane. The sooner we get this over with, the happier we'll both be. Now, if you'll just answer the question, please. No, not really. Our printers don't leave any identifiable marks. A witness helped us make a composite photo of the suspect. Would you mind taking a look at it for us? This remind you of anyone? Hey, this looks like a lot of people I know. Could even be me. <laughs> You're right, these composites can be a little vague. This guy looks a little bit like the composite. Maybe he's the one. Have you noticed anything unusual here at the bank lately? 
They told me about what happened to this guy yesterday. I wonder if he's gonna mention it. No, nothing. You know, nothing much ever happens in a bank. It's, uh, it's pretty quiet. One of your colleagues told me you were acting a bit, well, strangely yesterday afternoon. Yeah, I, uh, I had a little problem. I didn't really think it was that big of a deal. That's strange. His forearms are bandaged. I wonder what happened to him. Did something happen to your arms? Are my arms part of your investigation? No, of course not. I I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude. Is that you in the picture with the priest? Is he a friend of yours? That priest looks a lot like him. Maybe a member of his family. That's my brother, Marcus. This guy seems mentally unstable. I think he might be our man. I have to be sure. Do you have access to this type of paper, Mr. Kane? Yes, of course. I'm in charge of computer maintenance, so I have access to every type of paper we use. This list could even have been printed out on my printer, if that's what you want to know. Can you tell me where you were on the night of January 26th? Look, I, I wasn't in that restaurant, if that's what you want to know. How did you know that this was an investigation into the restaurant murder? But you said that... I didn't see anything about that. I'm gonna have to ask you to come with me down to the station while we verify a few things. And that's how my story ends. My attitude... That's my brother, Marcus. He's lying to me. I can smell it. Damn, maybe this is our guy right here. Stranger things have happened. Uh, I'm not feeling very well. I'm just gonna go and splash some water on my face. Go right ahead. I'll wait for you here. He's acting so strangely. I'd better take a quick look inside his desk before he gets back. There's something written on the picture. LKMK, June 2003. One piece of computer paper. I'll take that. There ought to be some fingerprints on it. That'll make it easy to see if this is our man. Feeling better? Yes, thanks. I don't have any more questions. I'll let you get back to work. Thank you for your cooperation, sir. 